How do I get all fruit in Animal Crossing New Horizons without a Nintendo Online membership? If you're playing ACNH offline and don't have friends to play local with either, this is going to be a challenge. How do I get cherries, apples, pears, peaches, oranges, and coconuts? In today's quick video, I'll show you. Uh, so, your fruit journey starts at the beginning. I... Let's reference back to yesterday's speed run video. Here we go. Um, when I first arrived to my island, I had pears as my native fruit. And um, after an in-game day or two, I got a letter from mom. The letter from mom had three apples in it. This letter from mom when you first start the game will always contain a fruit not native to your island. Um, and after I completed this speed run, I decided it'd be fun to go on some mystery island tours. And there's this great guide from Ninji, and he explains what each island has. Uh, most of the time you're going to land on an island with your native fruit and coconut. So as you see um, here, you know, there, there's most of the time it's a native fruit. On my particular item, we just saw in the flyover, and you can see them here, I have pears as my native fruit. But there's also a chance of landing on what he calls Fruit Island, or really Sister Fruit Island. And this is going to be your island's sister fruit. So um, it'll be different from your native fruit, and um, it's always going to be the same. Like, you're not going to get one time apples as your sister fruit and then another time peaches as your sister fruit. Your sister fruit will always be the same. And I wanted to share with you guys today, I landed on my sister fruit island. And as you see, my sister fruit, um, it's, it's orange. So I have oranges as my sister fruit. Every mystery island has coconuts, so it's easy to grab some coconuts for your island. And then um, my native fruit pears, and my mom sent me apples in the mail. And that's not my real life mom, that's like in game mom. This is no Bluetooth. Uh, no internet, like this is just solo play, offline, no Nintendo membership. I got four out of six fruits, which is pretty amazing. Um, I was looking everywhere for this, like, I had googled, you know, how do I get all the, the ACNH fruit offline? And I saw this video from King Clark, and let's just play a little snippet from it, okay? Uh, this is 15 seconds in. This is by Nook Miles tickets and traveling to different He's telling me that if I just keep going to more mystery islands, I will uh, be able to get all the fruit, but that's that's just not true. Um, as Ninji said here, your sister fruit 
will never change. Like it's always going to be this one. So let's go back to my island. And we're just going to take stock of what we got. Leftovers from our three star speed run. <laughs> okay, so here are the mom fruit, my native fruit, Mystery Island coconuts, and then now we have oranges. So let's let's plant an orange. And boom, we have four fruits now. Um, this is very exciting to me. I, I believe four out of six fruits is the max. However, really weird things can happen with villagers gifting-wise sometimes. And I just want to point out what I'm talking about. I think there's a very, very slight chance, very slight chance that a villager will gift you something weird. Rocco gave me that rocket, or tank, I mean. Here, I think I have a better recording of it. Oh no, we'll ha you know what? I'll have to do another video showing that. It'll be in the speed run clip, because that happened live yesterday. Um, but today, we now know we can get let me just shake off a couple of these so we can set them all out. We can get four fruits offline. And I'd say there's a very minuscule chance that a villager could gift you a random fruit. Because I had a villager gift me two Celeste DIYs yesterday, which is just insane. Like my jock villager, my jock starter villager gave me a rocket DIY and well we can just look and see what my other Celeste DIY is because I never actually saw Celeste in the game. Okay so I, I, a jock villager gave me a rocket and a satellite DIY so what I'm saying is villager gifting mechanics are strange I didn't think it was possible to get Celeste recipes any other way than Celeste so maybe there's a slight slight chance that you can get, like in my case, a cherry and a peach from a villager if I just kept playing on this island forever. Um, but I'm very happy with oranges and apples as non-native fruit. These are both huge boons. So this is my native fruit pears. This is the Mystery Island Fruit Coconuts. They will be on pretty much every Mystery Island you go to. This is my mom fruit, apples, and this is the sister fruit, oranges. Now, I think it's worth mentioning that I've done playthroughs where mom has sent me in the mail the sister island fruit. So I think the only rule with the mom fruit is that it is going to be a fruit other than your native fruit. So I, you know, there's a, there's a small unlucky chance suppose a one in four chance that you'll be getting your sister fruit from mom. But there's a three out of four chance you won't. So, um, yeah, it's totally possible to get four fruits in offline only mode. Okay, I just wanted to share that with you guys. I was really excited to have it recorded. I remembered it happening when I first started playing Animal Crossing offline and I couldn't find proof of it anywhere and it was starting to make me feel crazy. Like, did someone plant them when I got my online membership? Like, how did I have four fruit? But nope, it was mom, sister, Mystery Island Coconuts again. You're going to find those with ease. And then my native fruit. So. Four out of six fruits ain't bad, and I'm really curious if it is possible for a villager to gift you a non-native fruit. So if that has happened to you, if any of your villagers have ever given you a fruit that you didn't have already, 
please comment down below. I'm so interested in these kind of mechanics in game. And, um, you know, I'm hoping to explore and learn more of all this uh, crazy Animal Crossing randomness. All right, well, um, you know, thanks for watching and I hope to catch you all later. And I'm gonna find that um, clip of Tank giving me the Celeste DIYs and post that up later. So if you're interested in these sort of like, you know, Animal Crossing game mechanics, uh, give the channel a follow and hopefully you'll, you'll see that other video when it comes out. All right, uh, thanks for watching. If this was helpful for you, give the video a like. It'll help other people find it too. And um, I, I appreciate you watching. Thanks.